All right, everybody, welcome to the nest here for our matchup with West Stepford versus Collingswood Varsity Wrestling. Running a little late because we had a lot of JV matches, which is always a good thing. Uh, I'm John Craig, and with me tonight is Brad Entrican, uh, West Stepford region champion and state place winner. <laughs> welcome, Brad. Thanks. Thanks for having me. So we have a good matchup tonight uh, with Collingswood, who, you know, we were just talking. We had some challenges with last year. We had two losses to them last year. Um, big, big group two matchup here. Uh, what do you think so far? Yeah, I, I had this uh, match circled on my counter for sure. Um, as you said, we lost to them twice last year, but we were super young. We have all our kids back in Conswood, I, if I'm correct. We have 10, 10 remaining guys. Yeah. Um, we both have a heads-up loss from against Haddonfield. So this, this has huge implications for that postseason, that team. And um, I think it's going to be a battle tonight. I mean, Conswood's known to just come out and brawl. Um, their coach, Declan Moody, uh, wrestled with us back in our, our day, so we know he brings that mentality to it. So I'm real excited to see how we show up going out there. Yeah, that's been kind of a hallmark of Collingswood through the years is that even, even when they're a little down, and they're not down this year, but even when they are a little down, you still have to come ready to roll because these guys are conditioned well, they're, they're well coached, and they have a lot of fight. So, you know, tonight I think we have two teams that are, you know, in the upper tier in South Jersey, and I think we're going to be uh, in for a treat with a, a pretty entertaining matchup. Yeah, and this is, you know, what the third match with with this many you know people that are allowed to come if you remember the last two years it's been pretty not allowed a lot of uh, fans coming so this is something the kids are gonna have to adjust to as well oh yeah quite an atmosphere yep. as our yep. eagles come out here and take the mat have the advantage of being home here getting a nice warm up in on our own room so they should be pretty good and warm. Yeah, it definitely helps being being home with the, the weight, checking their scale weights and everything. So it should be a good night. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, looking at this on paper, Brad, I, I feel like uh, I feel like it's one that if we wrestle well and do what we're supposed to do and everybody does their job, we have a real good chance of coming out on top. But that being said, if we have uh, some performances that slip away from us, it, it could go the other way. So. You know, it's important that everybody comes out here and executes today. Yeah, I mean, I sound like a broken record whenever anybody talks to me, but it's going to come down to those getting the bonus points. Uh, for those of you that are not sure, like if we pin our kid, we get six points. If we just beat them by a point differential, it could be three, four, or four, five points. So pins are going to be huge. Yep. Um, and then making sure we're staying off our backs as well. And then those toss-ups, you know, it could go either way. We need to dig deep and get after it and get that win. So Absolutely, absolutely. And we're coming off, you know, we have a pretty tough schedule. We came right out of the gate, Haddonfield and then Paulsboro, a tough tournament. So records don't mean anything. So this is going to be a We talked night. about that a little bit Tuesday night against Sterling. You know, this team has four losses. <laughs> They're to Brook Memorial, St. Peter's Prep, Paulsboro, Haddonfield. There, there's no, there's no uh, soft Good losses on that schedule. Yeah, definitely not. West Everett High School, home of the Eagles. For today's home conference, all right, looks like we're going to.
Let's match on serve. All right, down. To the 150 down to the Panthers, Justin Pillow. Welcome back, everybody, as we get to our coin flip here. And if you didn't hear, we're starting at 150 pounds. So we'll see how the matchups go. Could be a lot of shuffling in, in some of these weights. Yeah, so we're going to do our best uh, <laughs> to keep an eye on. We'll know the West Effort kids, but for the Collinswood people out there, we'll do our best to let you know who's wrestling. It looks that way. It looks like we're going to be uh, having some, some shuffling around, I think. Always part of the strategy in a big dual mm -hmm. meet like this. All right, 150 pounds. West Stepford sends out Chris Hansen. Love the music. Might have to try to invest in some uh, <laughs> they were good surround sounds. Yeah, they have uh, walkout music now. Yeah. Right? <laughs> we were talking about that on Tuesday. Riley Thurston was up here, graduated last year, said he was jealous. They didn't get that last year. Yeah, we definitely didn't have it when we were, but that's a no. long time ago. <laughs> All right. Uh, 150 pounds for the Panthers, Nate Eifey. Nate Eifey. All right, so we have Nate Eifey for the Panthers, Chris Hansen Chris for Hansen. the Eagles. Nice ankle nice. pick Back by Hanson. Very nice follow Ooh. through here. Keep moving. Good job by Ify. Yeah, it was good defense there. Yeah, very good. Chris has really worked on his attacks. Um, he hasn't wrestled too long, a couple years, but he's really done a nice job. That was a nice ankle pick. Yeah, he's, um, he's very improved. You can tell that he's put some work in, done some work in the offseason. Real coachable kid, too. I've talked to him a couple times, and he listens. Yeah. Oh, work up. 
takedown there for Ify on a nice straight double. So we don't know a lot of the records, but you know, when, when you think about what the coach is, what are you thinking here, John? This this could be one of those toss offs we were talking about. Yeah, I mean, this, there's a lot of them in here. Mm -hmm. You know, you look around, especially in these middleweights. Um, you know, there's some matches that could go either way. Um, you know, these are the ones that you have to win to have a shot. To yep, win definitely. Game. All right, you got about a little under a minute here. We'd like to Chris to get up to his feet and get out. Let's get one. Yep, yep. So Ify looks like he's one of their better wrestlers. We can only go by what's on track wrestling. According gotcha. to track wrestling, he's 12 and one. Okay. Uh, senior. Chris Hansen's, uh, I believe he's a senior, he's a senior as well. As well. Yep. yep. All right, we got our one. You got a short time. Fight here, fight here. Fight. Like to see him fight a little harder for that defense of those shots. Yeah, I agree. He's got to get his hip back, hips mm -hmm. back a little bit. Hand fight in there, you know. All right, we got about 20 seconds. So again, we want to let's get out one. Let's get one here. Okay, could have been a caution there. There you go. Good fight here. Fight the hands. Stay on your feet here, Chris. All right, we got to get right back up. You know, 10 seconds left. You got to use these whistles in these situations. It's important when you're the bottom man to use these whistle starts. They're, they're beneficial to the bottom wrestler more than the top wrestler. So, especially in short time here, it'd be yep. nice to get a point. Uh, like to stick to the basics here. Short time, you want to get to your feet. We're going to end up down on bottom here. Yeah, Chris, was, Chris was looking grandy there. Mm -hmm. So Cons would chose bottom to start the second period. Good nice mat return. return. Yep. You can see Ify looking for that switch there. Chris needs to be aware of that. I like Chris staying under the arms here. So we had that nice ankle pick. Let's 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 get back to that. Let's move our feet. So you notice we want Chris moving his feet more when he's just standing kind of on the mat. That's how he's gotten taken down twice. Yeah, he needs to get back on his attacks now. Yep. But there he goes with an attempted up. shot. Keep but fighting here. Keep fighting. He's he's better off go. when he's on his offense for sure. Definitely. Yep. I was just a little too far, but I like the attempt. Takedown puts him right back in the match here, so definitely want to have some sense of urgency. Ify has a nice little outside leg yeah. attack there. He goes low below the knee. You know, it makes it tougher to, to fend that off when you're attacking below the knee, for sure. Definitely. Collins would tell them, tell yeah. Nate to let them up. They're looking, they're seeing a. They're looking you know, for a major here, yeah. yeah. So you folks at home, if, if uh, you win by a, a eight point margin, that's considered a major decision. So that would be four points for your team as opposed to three. And if you win by 15, that's called a tech fall. That would be five team points and a pin is six. So this is where a kind of a match within the match. Uh, you know, Collins was trying to win at least by eight. It's going to be two more takedown there. So we're at nine to two. And I would venture to guess Collins was going to tell him to keep cutting. Chris. Yeah, definitely. Although not in this situation, but short time. And it's our choice going into the third. Yeah, it's, you imagine. You got to go down. Take bottom. Yeah. There, yeah. Get, your, get your point. Makes it nine to three. He's probably going to let him up. So nine three. We need takedown here. So we this do. is where we want to keep attacking. One one takedown here, mm -hmm. and he puts him neutral. He doesn't even doesn't even start on top. One takedown here by Chris could could change this match a little bit, change the dynamic of it, and keep saving a bonus point. Yep. Obviously, you know, keep it to Raiders. There's that same attack. Yeah, he's gotten that attack all four times here. Mm -hmm. Keep fighting, Chris. Chris doing a good job crawling forward and making sure that he's not giving up any any extra points as Ify works up yeah, to try to put him on his back. But they're they're going to cut him oh, again. Cut him, all right. 
they might be thinking Tech fall. That's a that's a yeah, ways, that's a ways away. Points here. Yep. Oh, and or the oh, no, so Chris has to what, punch through. Yeah, he's got to get through Punch here. through with that left hand. Punch through. Fighting here. This is where we need it. All right. Good job fighting off your back there. You can rest assured they're going to cut him again. Yep. Chris needs to get after him here. He just needs yeah, he to. He needs to get on his attacks. Shelfed it there. That was a quick escape with the two, so we're. Chris, know where you are here. All right, he needs 14, one more takedown one for, take the, down for, ends for it. the tech here. Yep. Those back points really brought that tech fall on a little closer than it. Yeah, he's got to stay big here. Could have been. Don't want to give up a pin here. Scorekeepers are working on the uh, working on the score here. You got Coach Morell. He couldn't yeah. he couldn't be on the mic tonight, so he's running the score. I believe it's twenty to six. Twenty to seven. 20 to 7. So one takedown is going to be a tech fall here. If Chris could battle for those next 30 seconds to not give up this takedown, it would be huge. There you He's go. in on like a leg that. attack. Stay square here. Stay square with your hips. Don't give this up, Chris. Two hands on that. Stay square. Short time here. The 12, 12 seconds, seconds left. This is big. If he can hold on, lock his hands, bring it back. Come through. Nothing Come yet. through that back door there. He can get two here. That would be huge. Great job. Uh, great, great job. job. So we gave up a major, so that's four points. Yeah, definitely We're some right stuff right. to work on there, obviously, but way to finish strong and not give up that takedown at the end. It looks like he had some match awareness, knew what his job was at the end of that match. He did a nice job executing. But I'll tell you what, I was pretty impressed with Ify. Yeah, uh, nice leg attacks, you know. Try to hear who we have come up here for Collinswood as Nick Graziano takes the mat for West Effort. Justin Pilla Justin here. Pilla. Yep. So we're already moving up because Justin and uh, Nick, I believe, both weighed in for one, 150 in the wrestling 157. Justin Pilla is another senior. Looks like he's seven and four on the year. Nick does a nice job patrolling that elbow there. Stick this here. Start here. Keep Pilla's wrestling looking here. Dump. Big arm back. Let's see, get a fresh star here. All right. Pillow settled right into that bar there, Brad. Yeah, I, it went right to it. Yep. Something to be aware of. Almost looked for a second there like he was going to try to go to that bar tilt. I always tell my kids, if, if somebody does something within 10, 15 seconds of something, that's definitely that, their go-to. That's their stuff. Collingswood's had some. Not, not some, a lot of wrestlers in the past that have worked those bars, so it's something to be aware of. Bars and tilts are tough on top, yeah. tough to defend. So I like Nick fighting the hands here. we got to get that hand control first before he can get out. He's fighting those hands. Now he's got to keep them. Now he's got to get out. Nice job getting to his feet. Yeah, that was got a good escape. Nice job. Now let's see a takedown here. Takedown changes this up. You know, we talk about momentum. Um, confidence. Sometimes these kids coming out again in the early on in a match like this, it's a little of your nerves at this point. You should be settling in. And yeah, absolutely. Nick looks loose. He, you know, he looks like he's, you know, not not uh, the moment's not too big for yep. him. That's for sure. Definitely not. Controlling that arm. Let's work that ankle. Get your two here. Get your two. Get your two. You put your head in the side here and cradle it up, maybe. Big step, that's, that's two right two there. Right there. Like he's, got he's got to keep that, hook that leg. Nah, he's yeah. got to keep that leg hooked. Yeah. Looked like he had the leg hooked yeah. for a second. Pillow comes out. That was a good scoring opportunity yeah. there. Looked for a second there like he had that leg hooked. Yeah, he hooks that leg. That, that ref's going to give him two. All right, two to one. It's our choice, so we're going to... So we're deferring to Collingswood. Pillow takes down.
Let's see what Nick has on top here. Pillow, nothing crazy on nothing bottom crazy here. On top, yep. Yeah, just kind of hand fighting under there, but flattening out. He's got the one on one on the one side. I like the pressure Nick's putting on him. His hips are a little high. I'd like to. Yeah. Krause has had some nice wins this year. He was in the semifinals, the Marinelli tournament. Uh, he's he's looked pretty good. Yeah, Open. he's definitely grown. He, yeah. uh, you know, he did a little bit of clubs in the fall. Got yeah. some, got some matches, some mat time. Yeah, I think he was one of the kids that went up to SEPA a couple times for mm -hmm. some of those matches up there. I like him really running that one on one. Mm -hmm. yeah, he's doing a nice job on top here. So we're winning the hand fight down on the bottom, rolling those one-on-ones. I, I, I like them. Keep applying that pressure forward. Yeah, he's looking good running mm -hmm. that running that spiral ride there. That's a good, you know, a good little breakdown for a second there. It looked like he was going to try to enter a boot. And I like him. He's spiral. active. Yeah, he's jumping active. side by side. He's Stay running. Active. He's, running, keep, it. Keep running, he's running it. Keep running it here. Run it. Jump sides. Very active on top. Now at this point, definitely don't want to give up any points no. with 30 seconds left. I want to get crazy here. Love to get a turn here. Definitely. But obviously, even even just a ride out for two minutes here would be huge with us having choice in the third period. I'd like to see him Blake breaking flat before his point. He's all right. Okay. Uh, no points here. 15 seconds. Pinch those knees. Pinch those knees here. Keep your hips up. Hips up. Eight seconds here. No points. No points. Very no points. short time. Four Looks like seconds. he's going to be pretty good there for this short time. Nice job. Good job on bottom, on top. Yeah, when you can ride a guy out in the second period like that for a full two minutes, sometimes that can take a little bit of life out of him. Um, it's, it can be a little, uh, you know, dejecting when he can't get out from bottom. Absolutely. And exhausting, too. Absolutely. People don't realize how hard it is. Yeah. They think it's easy just to get out. <laughs> it is not. So Nick got out once. Um, One of those matches where if he gets out here, you know, takedown could win it. Mm -hmm. Could be the difference. There we go. Here, there, there's our one. I like. All right. All right now let's now get. We gotta right, get attack here. Right to the offense. Yep. And we saw Nick tough on top. A good takedown here. Could very well. Yeah. So we have blood time here for Graz. Looks like a little bloody nose. A little breather for. Yeah being attended to by our trainer, Gabby, one of the best around. Yeah, she's great. Gabby has a brother that wrestles for Highland 126. He's pretty tough. I just heard that. I didn't, I think he's a I didn't, I didn't even know that. Yeah. yeah. Well, we see Highland this weekend. Yeah. yeah. This weekend we have a quad. I believe it's Highland, Rancocas Valley, and Pemberton, Pemberton. if I'm not mistaken. Yep. At Rancocas Valley. John, one of the biggest strengths I, I think that we have as a team is really our conditioning. Uh, uh, absolutely. When you watch, we can really, they do a great job. Um, you've been in that practice room. Yeah, and they, they, they really put them through their paces in practice. Yeah. Those, this, kids, those kids work. This is where you're going to see it right here. I mean, Nick's attack, and I like to, you know, keep his hands a little lower. He's reaching and he's walking into them. Yeah, I'd like to see a little more level three here. We don't mm. really need that. No throw. throws. Yeah, we definitely. He did just hit Collins with the stall, though. That's, that's huge. And, uh, you know, as conditioned as we are, you know, Pillow looks like he's in pretty good shape mm -hmm. himself. I'm sure Collinswood yeah. is working hard in their room, too. A lot of tradition there. Next I, know, I know Coach Moody pushes them hard. There it is there right there. That. Beautiful. Look at that. that was just straight, straight run and throw him. Yeah. Now, tough on top here. We don't need anything crazy. I mean, obviously, we want to turn in a pin, but... And this is where our mat sense comes into play. You know, mm -hmm. I know with Paulsboro, we gave up a couple late-minute turns and different things like that. This yeah. was a great, great tough ride here for 46 seconds, looking for turns, looking for that half pins. A couple things uh, in that Paulsboro match go different. It could have been a, a different outcome yep. for sure. And hopefully they learn off of that. Exactly. That's where that, ex that experience comes in. And then he's going to stick that oh. arrow. Looked like he had that stuck Oops. for a second there. Very close, but 
I like the idea. Kraus is staying aggressive here today. Yep, I like him keeping his elbows short, right? We don't want his elbows getting tied under him. Mm -hmm. Keep that pressure forward. 20 seconds left here. Somebody's yelling stalling. I certainly don't see that. One either, one either man. Yeah, I don't. Both guys are working hard. Uh, we don't need that. Nothing crazy. I, yeah, yeah, short time. That's short that's a time. nice win. Great job. Way to way to go. Very very well done. Yep. Winner by decision for Eagles, Nick Graziano. That was that was a work, good tough work in all three positions. Yeah. You know, gets good. taken down, gets out. Has a nice ride in the second period and then gets out of escape and taken down again. Yeah, against the tough kid. Caleb Jackson. This is, uh, <laughs> could say he's a sleeper for West Effort. As nobody knows him yet. Coming on fast. Yes, sure. he is. Chris Lee for the Panthers. Caleb Jackson for West Effort. Caleb is just natural athlete john we were we've talked about him a lot uh really strong hips and Great he is hips. really becoming a, a, a good wrestler very quickly he's only wrestled for I, I, like about three years from my yeah. understanding I think he started in eighth grade he just yeah. has a lot of natural ability and he's he's like a sponge he's learning more and more um you can still see places where he, he has some inexperience but great athleticism great hips and and no quitting him whatsoever yep. he's in deep on a single Kind of going the wrong he's way cut here. That up, that yeah. Cut that corner, yeah, but he's, he's cracking the hip down here. But I'd like to see him cut the other yep. way. Keep circling, stay active here. We don't want the ref to keep circling here, keep moving, and that's what this kid will do. He will keep moving. He's actually, we were talking about it this weekend at the quad. He's dangerous on his back. He got put <laughs> on his back a couple times and came right through with putting. You know, putting guys back on their back, getting reversals with back points and pins. It's yep. He had a huge win, a pin against Paulsboro. Against the tough kid. Yeah. Against the tough kid, one of their one of their tougher guys. So, yeah, he's, he's coming along. And only a sophomore. Sophomore, and, and, you know, we're always looking for those bigger kids. So we're hoping, you know, he's only going to grow. So for yeah. two years, he'll yeah. be filling in up top. He has the frame to fill out for sure. Yeah, he definitely does. Nice high cross. Nice. nice. Finish it there. Now come Again. up, come up. He's going the wrong way yes. with it. All right, he switched off to an outside single. All right, now circle towards that. He wants to get that back elbow down on the mat. He's doing it. Come back door here. Yep. There we go. Collins was doing a nice hip job. Hip heist hard. Hip heist hard. This is where he's dangerous. Yeah, it's just nice job. Very nice. Nice tough takedown there. Yep. Collins did a great job defending that. Yeah. And, you know that was that was just grit and strength and short time here. No points. No points. No points. No points, two seconds, two, drop to a leg. Nice job. Nice job. Yeah, Caleb, uh, on top, he's, you know, still a little green, but he's, again, he's improving everywhere. Yeah. So I noticed there, you know, he was he was checking over with the coaches, and they were told to tell him how it's short time, and he, and he was listening. You know, he's he's like a sponge. Yes, he is. A bit of caution there. That's tough too. Like you know, on the mind, he, he Collins was defending for a good. Yeah, that was a pretty long kind of scramble there, and then yeah. he ends up get, getting taken down. Yeah. The match within the match, you'll hear a lot. So. Yeah. I used to preach when I when I was coaching here. You know, a, a wrestling match is 14 battles and one war. Yeah, absolutely. So Caleb's okay here. There you go. He got yeah. a stalemate. A lot of time left. Yeah, I feel like he's comfortable in that position. He's there a lot. I'm going right. to put him neutral. I don't mind that. He's still a little raw. He's locked hands a couple times in previous matches, so we want to make yeah. sure. And he, he just got that takedown. Let's get after it. A little feeling out process here again. I'd like to see a little offense and... Heavy here, heavy here. Shot. Inside ankle, cross face here. Keep your hips back. Get in that cross face and high leg. Yep. Oh, okay. Such heavy hips. Get 
Let's see Caleb go right back to that high crowd. Nice shot here. All right. Get that back elbow down. Keep circling. Now he can pop up through the. Yeah, let's, see. let's see him come up on his toes and start circling yep. towards that leg. But he's gathering it up you. for that. Right back ice. in this situation. I don't know. If Hit placed hard here. Yeah, we want to score here. We want to score. Just, just react here. There you Figured go. it nice out. Nice job. I like him on his feet. Yeah. We got about 30 seconds. I would definitely probably go for the ride here. Yeah, absolutely. You're up four to one. You know, obviously Russell Smart one, not two, if need be. But you want to try to ride him out here. And I believe it's our choice in the third. You look at Caleb. He is just looking up at the coaches. I'll tell you what. Yep. Chris is a senior for Collinswood. So he's been around a little bit. Mm -hmm. Nice job riding him out there. That's a very good ride. Taking bottom here. Probably, probably a good move to go on bottom there, but I'll tell you what, it's gotta be a tough decision to go there or on your feet, up four to one with two takedowns in the match. Never, e never easy to decide those things. No, it's, it's, you know, a lot of people say, you know, 90% of the time we're going to go down, yeah. but it, it really dictates on the match. Mm -hmm. I would have been okay with neutral. Yeah. Um, I, I, I've seen Chris, I've seen, uh, I've seen Jackson do well getting off the bottom of St. Chris. He's, he's got an arm bar here. He knows he's kind of in trouble. He's bringing his knees up. He's fighting it really well. Let's get to your feet here in that bar. He's pretty strong on that bar. He is, and you have to know your mat there. Caleb mm -hmm. needs to know he's almost out of bounds. And Chris is working to keep Good him job. in, but it's just not going to happen. And like we said before, he kind of knows where he's going now. Right there, locked. That was yes. nice. Oh, oh he oh, called he it and waved it. it off. That. Ah, he did it again. Here we go. Here we go. Chris score here. Very Two. nice. Now nice. we're looking. I, Half one on one here. They might cut him. Uh, cut him. Yeah, they're gonna cut him. We, yep. So we, we're gonna try to go for a major here. So we gotta get after yeah. it. I hope Caleb understands what's going on here with the points. You know, we need a takedown and a turn here. And this is where a lot of coaching, especially with a younger, inexperienced team a little bit, um, I know they watch film and they watch these matches, so I can guarantee the coaches are trying to explain to them some of this stuff. Yeah, absolutely. Leg attack here. Let's just stay big here. Caleb could give up a takedown if he gets in a bad situation. So we yeah. want. He's getting himself cross grain a lot here. Yeah. Um, that's something to work on for him, I think. If he starts cutting to that other side and not being cross grain, he's going to have even more success. Yep. Again, you know, he's kind of newer to the sport, but they, the improvement in him from the first match of the year to now is, is impressive. Yeah, to say absolutely. The least. I remember the first tournament, he was doing a lot of backing up yeah. and was telegraphing his shots, and you don't really see that as much. Short time here. This was another big win for for uh, nice West Effort. Good match, Caleb. Well done. Well done. Yes. Caleb Jackson. All right, we're at 175. Looks, Looks like we're going to have Andrew Ty coming out for West Deptford. One of our steady, steady performers here. Jake so we have Jake Rarsbo giving up quite a bit of weight. Yeah. So he weighed in at 162. Nice job there by Very Andrew. Nice. And Andrew is just a beast. He's just super strong. We talked about it last time. It's, you know, he, he's so strong. Everybody that wrestles him talks about how strong mm -hmm. he is and that tie strength. Yeah, tie strength. Uh, he's they call him a farm boy. He is a farm hunter. boy, strong kid. And he's yep. running this half. He is going to look for this half all day. He'll get it. He's got plenty of time. Doesn't have to rush it here. He's been so steady this year. Rosebrier fighting it off pretty well. 
Yeah, it was a good fight. We got plenty of time here. Rosebauer, another senior. Looks like he's seven and three on the year, so not a bad wrestler. Andrew's a, uh, or he's a junior, right? Yep. Yep. And he's only wrestled for I, th I think his freshman year, if I recall. Oh, really? I yeah. Didn't, I didn't even realize. Aiden, that. his his younger brother, one thirty eight. Aiden Ty, I've, I've coached for a few years. He's wrestled through the middle school, but I believe Andrew. I'm gonna cut him. I'm gonna cut him and get after him again. Good. We're gonna make these kids wrestle. There we go, right back to it. And what Andrew gives up with a little technique, he's definitely got in strength. Yeah, absolutely. Good gas tank, too. Mm -hmm. He will keep running this. He He'll get it. Yep, there you go. This is huge here. We got about 15 seconds. He's got to readjust here a little yeah. bit. Readjust his weight. There, there it is. Nice pin. That is huge. What a nice answer for West Effort. We lost the first one, and we come back with three nice wins and a pin here. Yep. Nice work. Looks like they wanted to see who uh, Collins was going to send here at 90. So we're up to 190 here. I think this is going to be Van Vincenzo Angelucci. Vincenzo Angelucci, okay. He weighed in 173. And so West Thetford, I believe this is this is Isaiah Bailey. Isaiah Bailey. I think this is Isaiah's first varsity match out here. Yeah, this is definitely something West Thetford in maneuvering. I don't know much about Isaiah. And there we go. Yeah, keep him in, keep him in. Oh, uh, hey, that was nice. Nice job there. Oh, yeah. Oh, run it. Nice defense, and he came right yeah. back at a shot. That's what I, I like to see. I like to see him keep two hands there. Good, pull it in. It's kind of hard. He's got to square. Yeah, he, he wants to square his hips here now. When he can switch off to a Good double leg right there. there. If there he switches go. to a double. Nice trip, trip here. Trip. We're going to get it. Yeah, nice takedown. Got our student section a little excited over there yeah. in the whiteout. That's right. It's a whiteout tonight for West Effort yeah. uh, students. Most of them were white. Pretty packed house here tonight. Isaiah doing a nice job running the one on ones on both sides. Staying under the arms, that's really important. Keep applying pressure forward. About 20 seconds left. I'd like to get out of here without giving up one. 18 seconds with this fresh start. You see a nice see a mat mat return. return. Yep, there you go. Nice. Beautiful. You know, when I was in the room, uh, Coach Shields talked a little bit about Isaiah and told me that he's got a lot of talent, and he's a kid that they're they're looking at as somebody that you know can come into these varsity situations and do I a mean, nice job. Yeah, he's definitely impressed me already. Very nice. I liked his re attacks. You know, the yeah. cons would shoot, he would defend, and then go right back at him. So we're going down here. Here we go, Isaiah. Good movement. Good movement. Oh, oh, no, don't get stuck. No. Uh, punch keep through. coming. Keep coming. Punch through, keep Isaiah. Fighting here. He's all Good right job. there. Yeah. Good job. Should be two. No, oh, three. That's a, okay. Three backs there. Three backs. All right. That's all right. Let's work our way up. Just got caught there. Got to work up to his base here. 
I'd like to see him try to start pressuring back a little bit, getting that weight back. You know, he's he's got to get up to his knees here, mm -hmm. get to his base. Bowser's doing a nice job rolling the one on ones. Oh, he's high. He's high there, yeah. Let's get to your feet here. We're out here. We're out. Let's go. Get in that cross. Nothing stupid. Nothing out. stupid. All right. Way to bow. Now let's get back up. I like his chances if he can get up to his feet. It looks like he's, you know, if he can get up there, I think he's going to be able to get out. But I don't like being flat being here. Being flat here, yep. yeah. I agree. And you can see, you know, Angelucci definitely working that bar, working trying to bar slide here. that bar in there. Is he strong here? He's fighting. He knows how to kind of fight that bar. A lot of time left here. Uh, that's a tough way. spot to be in. Keep fighting here. Wow. Come on, keep fighting. That is a tough spot to be in. Uh, wow, that's a fast pin. That was pretty fast. Mm. You know, I mean, as long as you're consistent with that, I don't have a problem. If I that's what you, how you're going to call them, that's fine, you know. But little, little quick, but that's a tough job. And like yeah. I said, if you're consistent, that's that's a good yep. thing. I agree. That Come was tough. He had a bar and a half. Yeah. You know, that's – we got Mark, Marcus Carter here at 215. Marcus is a junior. He's had a good year. I believe this is going to be Van Zandt. Yep. Yeah. Number Eagles, Marcus Carter. Jeremiah Van Zant weighed in at 188, so he's not a true 215 pounder, which neither is Marcus. So they're both yeah. 190, both 190 pounders here. Marcus weighed in at looks like uh, 183. So Marcus will go after. He will. Yes, he, he has does. no fear. <laughs> I think Marcus is best when he stays controlled and looks for his, his shots and doesn't get up, tying up and go upper body. Yeah, he's, he's pretty powerful with his double. When he's, yeah. when he's hitting that hard and penetrating through, he does a pretty good job. He's got that hook there. It's a like good, to good use position it. Yep. for him. Just a little elbow pass. I'd like to see him commit more to that shot, but he's definitely being active, moving. About 27 seconds left. Try to get some action going here. Uh, you got to tighten up Marcus Segger. <laughs> yeah. yeah. It's a little loose. Short time here. About 10 seconds left. It's our choice. Mark is going to go down. They choose to go. They elect to let him right up. So, yeah, they didn't. They didn't like their chances on top. Both wrestlers is really looking to find the position they want. They're, they're hand fighting, they're moving, but no real, real yeah, attacks. There's one Marcus. Marcus. All right. We gotta set it up. We can't just go straight for double his arms out. So he's gotta move them, he's gotta be moving his feet. And Marcus is usually pretty good with the movement on his feet. Mm -hmm. I'd like to see him start attacking a little bit more here now.
couple attempts here with Marcus. He's got to really commit, though. He hasn't really committed. I wouldn't mind him going back to that underhook and using that. Five Kyle's, seconds. Kyle's a little, little flat-footed here. I think if you just hit a nice, you know, nice little setup and penetrate, you're going to be all right. Just got to pull the trigger sometimes. Yeah, I definitely like to see more attacks here from Marcus. So, referee's giving him a little restart here. Not quite sure why. But I'm not sure what that was. He's talking a little talking to him. Maybe there was some headbutting going on or something. I'm not sure. There we go. There's the stall. Yeah, okay. definitely. I mean, let's keep we out, though. Let's, there we go. There we go. Beautiful. Nice. Beautiful. There you go. That was huge. Nice Short time. Let's finish by. on top here. 20 seconds. I like to see him going forward, not sitting back on his hip. Nice job. And we get a little taste of how Conswood's on bottom because they're going to go down in third period most likely. Yeah. So we want to see if we want to. Really nice slide by there. Yeah, it was very nice. Very well yeah. timed. Got that cross wrist there. Marcus has been pretty tough on top this year, honestly. So I think, I think he's pretty good here. Great if he can get a quick two. Doesn't look it, but if he can continue this on top. He might get a turn here, third period. Very nice. Looks like uh, Kyle's chose neutral. Blood time. They do not want to go down. Yeah, they and don't like it, Matt wrestling with this. That is surprising with a 3 nothing score that they wouldn't take bottom, try to get yeah. one, and then a takedown he ties it up. You know, yeah, I agree. It with a stall call, yeah. and then yeah. he just got taken down. So, it's interesting. Yeah, I mean, as it is now, you need two takedowns or, or a feet to back. You know, so they're, they're not comfortable under there for whatever reason. I, I, I'd like to see Marcus continue to get after him. You know, we just yeah. saw a beautiful, like, keep attacking. Um, you know, I don't want to see him be content and try to just circle around for two minutes. I agree. I agree. When, when, when he got after it, he scored. Yep. And, you know. And I'm sure the coaches are telling him that right now. Yeah. And, and listen, the, the stalling call against Kyle's opened things up a little bit, too. You Definitely. know, sometimes. Something like that needs to happen to get the, get the action flowing. There we go. Third period, two minutes left. Marcus is up 3 nothing. West Effort leads 12 to 10. So this is a very important match here. Rest on our laurels here. It's stay aggressive, Absolutely. which Marcus looks like he's trying he to is, do. Yeah. He's moving well. Moving him, circling him. I mean, in wrestling, you see Mark's doing a really nice job of moving his feet. I mean, that that's the big yeah. thing. Your hands move, your feet move in your stance. Once you go flat-footed is when. Yeah, we talked about that with, you know. Chris Hansen, yeah. Yeah. And Marcus usually does do a good job mm -hmm. of keeping his feet moving. That's one of his strengths. And there's a leg attack. He can't give up oh, this two he's here. Keep his head good up. mat awareness. Good mat there awareness go. there. Marcus's head down was was down with that shot. If his yep. head's up. Seconds left. Van Zant's leaning a little bit here. I feel like that slide by could be a factor again. He's leaning in. Yep. Flat footed here. I like to see. And I'd just like to see it because it was nice. Yeah, it was very nice. <laughs> uh, we'll have to check back if we can get the. They do a nice job here sometimes of catching that little replay. Yeah, that was beautiful. So now we need nothing crazy. Now we're down yeah. to 25 seconds. We have no stall calls. Yeah, this is where smart this, wrestling Yeah, just, just circle here, bang them, move, and nothing. Yeah, we don't need to be on the collar tie there, letting him on the collar tie where he can try something big. Yeah, we don't really, we don't need a takedown here. Yeah. And Marcus is staying very active. Yeah, very so. active. Short time, great match. 
interesting. I see Collinswood and the coaches, they're, they're clapping and they were. Winner by season three, Eagles, Marcus Carter. They're happy with that loss for some reason, which is interesting. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not sure, you know. Or maybe they're just happy with the effort there. Maybe. Two guys battling. So we have heavyweight here. We have your nephew here, Colby yeah. Boy. This is his first time wrestling at uh, heavyweight. Yeah, he's definitely going to be giving up some size here. He's a 190 pounder, so. Nine better, two twenty-two, two twenty. Cole, uh, first year here in West Effort, obviously. Yeah, he has been great for this team. In case you don't know, it's John's nephew he wrestled at Shalik. Um, nice moved here to West there. Effort, nice takedown, and we're definitely looking for six here. And Cole. Um, Cole has put in so much time and so much work, and it's it's paid off for him. He's having a great year so far. He's had a great career so far. So I'm hoping to wrap up the senior year strong. Yeah, I'm excited for him. He, he's tough. And, uh, you know, what he's done for this team, just, just with his leadership, walking in, um, you know, as a senior, kind of running that. He's trying to run that corkscrew. Yeah. He doesn't have to rush anything here. He's got plenty of time. Sometimes when, when your job is to, to get a pin, you know, you, you, you kind of try to go out there and get it within a minute. And Yeah, and that's... I tell kids, you, you have six minutes, you know, make sure you... Yeah. But and yeah, listen, it, it can be tough to... Naeem knows his, knows his job there, it looks like, a little bit. He was, you know, posting out, you know. Mm -hmm. He's, he's going to do everything he can to avoid giving up bonus points here. Looks like we're going to cut him here. Cole's going optional start. So here he gets to decide if he wants to stay on top or let him up. And that's definitely what we need to do here is Cole just keep keep making him wrestle. Yeah. There's that little slide by it. Don't need to be there. Nah. But against the bigger opponent. Stay low, stay on his legs. Tough here, circle out. Use this underhook, there it Very is. Very nice. Run that, the that's all day. Now beat that, that up, beat back. that up, there it is. Take your time here, you're good. Get your situated and it should be over. I mean, that nice was try. a four second call, but hey, we'll take it. Very nice. Nice job there, yep. one feet to back. Just being patient. All right, it's gonna bring us around to our smaller guys here, and here comes Talon Taranoni. <laughs> Tough kid. Yeah, Talon's a junior for us, he's a team captain. I think this is Mason. Luciano, yep. Beautiful lower leg attack yeah, there by Talon. Nice. Looks like Mason's a freshman. West Stepford holding a 21 to 10 lead here in this dual meet. Talon's another tough kid. Um, you know, had a, had a really good sophomore season, having a great junior year. Mm -hmm. um, you know, he's had some battles already in this season, and we talked about tough freshman from Haddonfield, uh, Mike, Mikey Lamb. Yeah. Talon lost to him in a dual meet, which was pretty devastating. He was expecting to win. And then, what, not even a week later, he yeah. sees him in uh, a really tough tournament. Yeah. It was probably the toughest weight class of that tournament. Oh, yeah, that, that weight class was loaded, and that was a good match, the Marinelli tournament between him and Lamb. And listen, Michael Lamb is a legit, legit mm -hmm. freshman. He's a tough, tough kid. But... Uh, Talon is Talon's very talented wrestler. I've been impressed with him last year, but even more so this year. Um, he's another one. He's put in a ton of time. Um, you can see as he gets out there and fires off that quick takedown, he's aggressive. He's ready to go at all times. So. His leg attacks. You know, he he last year he was 
predominantly just the outside single, outside single, and he's really starting to change it up again and, and get different attacks, which is really going to help him getting through to where he wants to go, getting through regions, getting yeah. the states. He's developed a beautiful, a beautiful low single, which you mm -hmm. just saw out there. Um, I've seen him hit that several times this year where he literally just sits the kids right on their butt, um, and it, it, it's, it's just a powerful six-pounder. Same thing here with Tal. We want to just, you know, stay technical. You don't have to do anything crazy here. The turns, the points will come. Yeah. So we're going back on our feet here. Some people calling for a stall there. A little early, but... Yeah, I was going to say, I'd, I'd give him a little bit more yeah. opportunity, but... Again, I would think for, you know, my eyes, we need six here. We want six, yeah. and... There's the stall there. And Mason's just a freshman. You yeah. can kind of tell by looking at him out there, the way he's moving and wrestling a little bit. He looks like he's probably a pretty good freshman. I think he's been around a little bit. Yep. Talon defers. Mason's going to take down here. Talon's tough on top. He is tough on top. He likes legs. He runs legs a lot. Feels comfortable there. Looks like he's working. Possibly a bar on that side. That trap. Yeah, he's got the trap. I think he's. Entered his boot here. Let's see if we can get to work here. We'll frame that face and start working. Here we go. Nice job there. Getting real close to a count. Yeah, Not close quite here. yet. Try to frame that face under the chin. Yeah, a couple things you can do there. Let's. Just going to keep that leg or he's going to let it out and try to work. They're going to try to cut him, get after it. I think that's a good move. I yeah. Think, I, mean, I think you need stall call. Yeah. You know, Town's definitely going to stalk him. There's that nice thing right to his back. Right to his back. Oh, just run got it, under. Keep it. that arm. I'd cut him right away. And that's what yeah, Coach Shields is yelling. Yeah, you got plenty of time. Yelling. Yeah, get right back on him here. a very dominating four to three match Brad yeah it is <laughs> <laughs> you, sometimes the score doesn't always tell the yes. story and I mean Mason's being he's wrestling smart he is he is like I said it's just a freshman I you can tell he's he's, he's been around I'll bet you he's coming in here with some good youth experience yeah So John blood time's Brad, done. Jimmy Rollins and Brad Etchigan. Oh, ah, we got a, little, I, I didn't hear that part. shout out for the state place winners in the house. <laughs> and in addition to our state place winners, our one and only state champion is in the house, Frank Pulio. Is he? Oh, yeah, up there in he the is. Right, corner, next to, uh, right with my dad and Mr. Shields, Mr. Shields up there, our state champion. Looking to add to that, hopefully. Our next yeah. home wrestling match will be next Friday. As Corey Fisher in the house. Years. We were talking about brothers at the last telecast, and I actually, I actually forgot to mention the Fishers, who are probably our winningest yeah, brothers I was say, ever. Right. <laughs> Between Mark, Dylan, and Corey, all of them studs. Corey, a two-time state placer. Multiple region championships in the family and district championships. Dylan, an All-American. Rowan College yeah, of South that, Jersey. Yep. Very, very uh, tough, tough family there. Surprised I forgot to mention that. Yeah. <laughs> All right, town so Town's going to gonna right get after it here. It's 4-3. Yeah. He's not happy with this, I can guarantee yeah. you. He's got to keep wrestling here. This is what I was talking about. Let's get one here. Oh, Lucy got his take down here. Yeah, I mean. 
Keep running, keep running, keep running. I mean, Mason's going to get hit again. Yeah, he's going to hit again. And, and locked hands. And, locked and hands. it should be stolen. So there's locked. There's the point. Free move here. Talent's and fine. Talent's yeah, he's going to cradle it up right two. here. So this is what I was talking about, John. Like, you know, let, let's. This kid's tough. So. Yeah. Uh, give my. My uh, hat's off to Mason, though. He's battling. He out is there. battling. He's, he's not folding. He's getting after yep. it. Yeah, I have a feeling he's going to be tough for the next three, four years. Yeah, definitely. Talon with a nice switch nice there. Switch, Very yeah. good. Cradle it up here. He's got the bar he's got now. The bar he's got the trap. bar now. Big, big step. step. Big step he's here. He's going to turn his hand. I don't, yeah, there you go. Come on. Keep stepping. He's going to get it here. Stepping. Take your time, plenty of time here. There it is, step over and sit. If you can sit, it I should be. In good shape. He's working hard here. This puts it at 12-5. If Mason's yeah, able if to fight through this, he's gonna, out his to, hips. he's gonna have to cut him and take him down again. There, there it is. is. Nice job. Solid work. Winner by fall for Eagles, Taron Taranoni. Makes it 27-10, West effort. In this big duel meet with Collingswood, it's nice to see starting to widen the gap a little bit as we have Anthony Catanzo coming out for the Eagles. And He's I think having this a nice year. Lino Badalini. Lino's yeah. been around a long time coming up through the program. Um, I think he's a freshman. Yeah, 8 and 3. And Catanzo, a junior. Looks like we got a little blood on the mat. Ant's had a nice year. He had a big pin against Paulsboro. Yeah. Some nice wins this year. This this could be a good match here. This could be one of our uh, our more contested matches of the day. I'm looking forward to it. Yeah, I've known Lino for a couple years with his dad. Lino's been on a lot of wrestling, a lot of club teams, different mm -hmm. things like that. So he is definitely going to come out tough. Eight, eight and three on the year, a good mark for a freshman on a Pretty tough schedule, Collingswood has. There's a lot of matches left, so we yeah. want to make sure we keep keep attacking, keep working hard. I've been very yeah. impressed. We've done a nice job attacking and everyone doing their jobs. You get it. Uh, coming out up out of that throw. Throw. Yeah. yeah. You know, very aggressive off the start. Yeah, he came right after it. Yeah. yeah. So again, katano has got to kind of Keep an eye on that. Keep his elbows in here. Nice. Nice. Back door here. Pop, 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 pop. Oh, that's not yeah, legal. That's, that is illegal. Mm -hmm. Interesting. All right. So that's a scissor to the head, and you can't even figure four you anymore, correct? Nope. You cannot touch like that at all. Yeah, you used to be able to figure four to heads. You can scissor the body. Got to watch that elbow. Tough to see. I'm trying to see around our referee. He's got here. that ankle. He's got to keep that inside ankle. I want to see him uh, let go of it. Keep oh, nice here. job by Ant. Recovering here. Put that leg in. Hook That's that leg. That's oh, he had oh, it. Lino doing keep a good Keep wrestling job. here. Keep wrestling. It's a good scramble. Yeah. Ant's got to really get in that high leg, man. Getting that cross facing high leg. Yep. Break him to that hip. Should score here. Uh, he was trying to cradle. I would have rather see yeah, just, get him too here. Just stay in that high leg. And hips, heavy hips here. We can't give our hip Cross position away. Here. Heavy, heavy, heavy. Good scramble. Ant's doing a nice job staying heavy there so far. Nice little hip crack down there. I'd like to see him get his hips, legs back here. His legs are too close. All right, stalemate, nice stalemate. Back to our feet. Nice scramble by both guys there. Yeah, definitely. I like Ant's aggressiveness. Yeah, just He's just got to get his head to the yep. outside. I, I don't like him. Say. Heavy here. Oh, hip up here. Do not give this up. Do not give up your position here. Let's score. 
pop our head. You got to get your head out and you score here. This is a tough situation. Post heavy. There, there it you is. Go. Nice job. Nice job. Short time here. Finish on top. Pressure five, forward. About five seconds left. Stay tough on top. Pressure forward here. No, don't. Oh, man. That is a bad mistake. You cannot. Yeah. You got to be, you know, two See seconds Coach left. Coach and Coach Shields. Correct yeah. and, and on that, knowing knowing your match a little bit. And it, it, listen, it's tough sometimes. The gym's Absolutely. loud. Absolutely. Yep. Gets a little overwhelming in a tough match, but they're going to correct that for sure. Hopefully that doesn't come back to, to bite them later in the match, getting yeah. up that point at the end of the period there. But so far, pretty good job by Anthony. I like the aggressiveness. See how Ant's on top here. Threading oh, that he goes bar. goes right to the bar. If he can catch that trap there, he's got to watch his weight. Anthony is a pinner. He's, he gets a lot of pins. He had a pin against Paulsboro. Potentially dangerous. Got to watch out for. Yeah, had a pin, pin against a tough kid from Paulsboro. They bumped up. Uh, I believe it was Horton, if I'm not mistaken. Um, had a nice pin in that match. So he, he, has, that, he yep. has that big move ability. Watch, Watch switch, switch here. here. Good. Stay under your arms. Well, you know, moving. He's Watch not Peterson giving up. Here. Yeah, you got to get your arm out. Watch Peterson Watch here. Watch Peterson here. And here it is. Hip up. All right, one, not two. Watch, Watch your leg. Get your leg here. back here. Get both your legs back. And still technically in control. I'd like to see a wizard here. He's still. Oh, he gave up. Ugh. All right, gave up reversal, so 3-3 three, three with a minute left. Let's see what yeah. Ant's got on bottom. It's uh, our choice, third period. See, Coach Moody's arguing he wanted one and two there. That is definitely, uh, I would not have given one and two there. I would not have either. But you're would coach, you were coach for how many years? I'm sure you yeah. were, oh, I'm absolutely. sure you were reaching a couple times. Yeah, that's, that's your job. <laughs> yeah, it's tough being a coach. Out there trying to fight. Fight for your guys, fight yep. for every call. A little bit more blood tie here. Coach Araldi coaching up in here. Congratulations to West Everett High School boys basketball coach Gabe McEwen on his 100th win as boys coach against Haddon Township last week. Wow. Plenty of time here. Very I'd nice. like to Just announced Coach McEwen got his 100th win for the basketball team. Congratulations. So I love this YouTube channel. They shout out to Mr. Kirchner and all the team working for him. They were talking about it last night on the basketball game. But um, I love this YouTube channel. I was watching the game last night. Yeah. Um, Aiden Kramer and Corey Ratcliffe had a really good game. Tough game, tough loss to Audubon. But yeah. All the sports are on YouTube, and it's enjoyable to watch. You can see the score and it's hear great. some commentating. It's, it's great to have yep. this feed. And they do such a great job with it. So many people complimented it. So oh, yeah. It looks like a college feed. All right, Anthony, let's get back to this. Tied up 3-3, second period. About Definitely. 50 seconds. We need the score here. He's got to get off that ankle, which he does. up to his base here before he can get anything. Lino's smart. He's going to work this, the line here. If he gets into trouble, he's going to go right out of bounds. he got to kind of work in. Hips out, use hips this, out. Use this position. Right. Nice mat return. Yeah, it was. All right, we got a fresh start here like you were talking about a few matches ago. Got fresh it. start with 18 seconds. You have to take advantage of them. You know, create some space and, and try to take advantage of this quick restart. Lino doing a good job keeping his weight forward. Yeah, Lino's tough on top. I, I don't know, John. Are you going down third period or are you going neutral? I'm going down. Yeah. I'm going down. I think that. I guess there's no harm in it. Up. Hasn't really been threatened to turn. Yep. I'm going down. Two, two minutes is a long time. There was a couple times where I thought Anthony had an opportunity to score. Yep. You know, he, he hasn't really had uh, any danger of being turned at this point. 
from that position. So, uh, you know, looks like they're going to put them neutral yeah, they're anyway. they're trying to figure out. So they want to go neutral. Yeah. So good thing we took down because that's the free point. Yeah. Other than just going, starting right on our feet. But now, listen, takedown's going to win this match. So. Absolutely. And just can't be diving in. Watch those double unders here. He's got to keep his arm down. He sees that leg. He can reach it here. We don't. No, oh, face him. Yeah. Hips out, hips out, hips out. Keep wrestling here. No points. Good, Good job. Ant's got to control his shot yeah. here. He's got to control those elbows. We, we, don't need a, we don't need a throw, but there it is. Oh, oh, sit, 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 sit. <laughs> Nothing yet here. I'd rather see him get his two here. I'd rather see yes. him turn. Yep. Just get your points. No, don't worry about it. Ant did a nice job in the beginning of the match with this, this yeah. position here. He's got to. Keep that ankle elevated. Cannot let Lino push off of it. Mm. All right, one minute. Tough Short time here. Yep. We got we to gotta get to our feet. Yeah, you got to work up here. We need one to tie it. 5-4 match here. Let's get a fresh start. Know where, know where you are on the mat. Get moving. Get one or get a fresh start. And that's the first stall first call. Stall. That's, so he was, Lino was just kind of laying on top, laying parallel. Todd's with coaching staff, really vocal about this when they know they need this match. Yes, this is definitely. I don't like Ant's first move He's here. Going for a tilt. First move was just kind of head down, and so we got to work up here. We still need one and escape to tie it. To our feet here, to our feet. He's got to get to his feet here. He's got to get up. If Ant doesn't move, the ref won't call Lino for stalling. So he's got 25 seconds to ride him out. He's got to move. He's got to get his head up. 10 seconds. Still parallel here. I don't think he's going to get yeah, hit. I don't think he's going to hit him. Good win for Lino. Yeah. And Collinswood. Brings it to 27 13 West Deptford. Definitely a win that Collinswood needed to stay in this dual meet. With some tough kids coming up. Yeah, this is where you're not quite sure what's uh, what we have here. Okay, so we got Anthony Conway for us. And it looks like Isaiah Townsend. Yeah, I think so. Um, Isaiah is tough. Isaiah is one of their better yeah, wrestlers. Going, yeah, went right for upper body. Nothing here. Keep wrestling in. He is a strong, I believe, a senior. Oh, another fast pin. Yeah. And just like that, we're back in the match here, 27 to 20, uh, 19. Tough kid. Like I said, one of, one of their best kids. Yep. And they're, they're back in this match. This is our big match here. We got Owen and I'm not Owen. sure who this is. Well, they just sent sure somebody out, happened. so I don't they know how they can let, out on yeah. The so he's got to wrestle now, but I don't know if it's. I don't know if you forgot a mouthpiece, maybe? Oh, uh, maybe. I think that might be what happened there. I don't know. You got Owen Entrick in here, who's having a good year. Your son here, another kid that's put in, a, put in a lot of work. This gym is loud right now. It is electric, and this is what wrestling's all about. Yep, and this is uh, Nathan Plaza, I think they said. Um, he don't... Uh, be smart here. Potts is a tough wrestler too. Keep have, wrestling here. Have, uh, have these two ever met before? I, I think this is the plot. I think Plots beat Owen last year. Okay. Um, 
if I'm not mistaken, he'll be mad I said this. He got caught in a splatel, <laughs> which was all over Instagram, and I, oh, no. I don't know if that was hit, this. This was did him. Did it or end not. up on Splatel City? Yes, it did. Oh no. Oh yeah, I was getting texts too. <laughs> <laughs> well, hopefully we don't get a repeat yeah. of that. Nice shot nice by Owen. Run it. Beautiful nice job. leg Work attack. Up. Very nice. Beautiful. That's what we say. If he's attacking, he's winning. Exactly. He's tough on top. I don't know how Plotz is on bottom, but Owen has a nice bar. Oh, a little premature out of bounds, but. Owen's got a nice bar series, and he's tough on top. Try not to look at him. It's a little tough when you're announcing and they're facing you. It is. It <laughs> is. Hips up here. I've seen Owen in some tough matches with some tough kids, so I, I think. He's yeah, in he's good had some shape. tough losses here this year. Very happy here. He's Elevate got that here. Tilt. So he can bar it up here. He does a really nice job. He bars it with a one-on-one -on -one here. Got to recover that bottom knee there a little quicker. Get him in your pocket. You know, Brad, I like to tilt myself. And that's that's where he's got to recover on, right here. There nice. it is. Right there. Nice two. Yeah, we got at least two. two. Now he now bars it up. It. Beautiful. Let's go. Jump sides here. Back to the he's tilt. He's going to go back to the tilt. He should get, he should get a new count here. Yeah, I don't know why he's... I don't know if it's a new count, but at least... Get yeah, him. he should come back with a five count here. Come through. Don't panic. Oh, Just come up. Nice okay. job. Good, good. There's his three. Let's stay smart. Watch the splatel. Watch that splatel. Hit heist hard That's here. That's back points right there. Why is he not counting? Straight Sit. back. That's there back it is. points. He He's should have count forever. He's, He's getting points here. Was he... Was He's definitely got, he should have back points. I don't know what this kid's got on Owen. Owen just I needs think, a patient. He's I got at least he two back. Yep, gave him the backs. All right, good. That's a 7 nothing win. That's I'll a nice period. What, a little yeah. crazy, but. Yeah. Definitely, Plotz looks like a kid that might look for a splatel. Yeah, he was. So, Owen's a little aware of that now. I want to see Owen get after here again. Right back to that straight uh, double. Yeah, absolutely. I told him that. He's got a tough double because he will fight through it. Mm -hmm. I don't like him seeing him dancing around here. Let's get after it. You should be feeling confident right now. Wizard down hard. Wizard, Wizard down hard. hard. Wizard hard. Wrestle here. Don't give this up. He's Wizard got that down. inside thigh pry. If he just keeps heavy pressure here, head up here. Limp leg through. Wizard down. Limp leg through a little. Don't let him shelf this. No, nah, don't. I don't know what he's looking here, Owen. I would just stay pressure. Get big, get big. Look where you are. Get your score. Nice job. Right. Let's get right back out of here. There you go. Run it. Just run it. Run that half. Run that half. Run that half. Reset him. Very nice. You know, Owen was kind of calm there. I was yeah. probably a little more nervous, but... Looked like he knew where he was. Looked like he almost had a little, mm -hmm. almost a Granby roll there from that position and came out on top. It's good match awareness, good mat awareness. Plenty of time here. He can, I don't understand those out of bounds. Out of bounds, these rules need to be fixed with that. Either college out of bounds. One one leg out of bounds is the way to do it. That's what they need to do it because I've seen refs call out of bounds when there's four touch points there and then mm -hmm. two. Again, upcoming action. Yeah, it's definitely a lot clearer in college when you can see just that one leg yeah. has to be in and, and, and you can wrestle on the out-of-bounds lines. I know one of the arguments against that is that a lot of the high school mats are smaller on the, yeah, on the sure. outer circle. Makes um, sense. It's a shame, though, because it's a much easier way to, yeah. to, to be a judge of whether they're in or out. I don't really like this, uh, this break, but blood time, unfortunately. I want Owen to get right back to that leg attack, that straight double. Oh, he's on top right now, right? Mm -hmm. So yeah. I definitely want to see that tilt. But, yeah, I, yep. I want to see that leg attack. Yep. And I don't need the, he doesn't need to force the tilt. You're up 9-0 nope. nine, nine nothing now. I mean, it's to the point now where, where Plotz is going to be looking for a big, big thing. So you just stay technical. Technique will win. Does it say, do you have what grade Plotz is in? I believe he is a sophomore. Yep, sophomore. Okay. Because I know there is two plots, too. Yeah, there's a map yeah. plot a little up. Yep. All right, 53 seconds here. It's Russell Smart. Same thing. Let's stop that first move. Refresh here. 
Heavy oh. pressure forward. Make sure you got your hand control before you go for that stuff. He's doing a nice job pressuring forward, keeping that knee right up the butt there. Get that cross wrist. Here it is. I mean, it's there. Just got to make sure you're, you know, yeah, secure he definitely that had the cross grips. wrist. No one doesn't get too nervous under there either with that tilt. So he's got a leg in. Doesn't ride legs a whole lot. He's got to get his hips a, up. Got to be a little nerve wracking watching him wrestle here while you're announcing. I know. <laughs> yeah, it's a little tough. I feel like that with my <laughs> nephew too. It's it's a little nerve wracking. Yep. Let's just keep that leg in here. Let's finish it on top. Short no time, points here, no points, time. no points. Smart. Nice job, good job knowing where you are. One second, and uh, I think it's our, we gotta go down. And Owen told me this was the one that splayed him, so if I was wrong, it's his fault. <laughs> <laughs> Owen's looking good on top. I think that's uh, the area going, where he's shown a lot of They're going back up top, huh? It's our choice. Should be our choice because I believe. Yeah. Did we go down? Looks like looks like it's Kyle's choice. Okay. I don't remember what. Looks like. They're going move. neutral. Yeah. I want to see attacks. Double legs. Brad getting a little coaching Sorry. in on the broadcast. Yeah. I hope nobody saw that. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody saw that. <laughs> That's okay. I'm fine with it, yeah. <laughs> I coached him since he was five. Absolutely. He's a coachable kid. He I want to see him attack here. I don't want to see him dancing around. Reattacks, you know. Like we said before, right back to that double, man. That was beautiful. And it, Try it was, that little cross dog. Yeah, that double's right there. Just it lower is. and blow through him. He hangs that arm. All right, I got to work. Don't let him sink this half in here. That too deep. I was gonna get his head up here. Head up. He's he's fighting it well. He's fighting it well. Head up. Head up. Don't let him get it deep in. There you go. Nah, no, no, Grammy. Nothing stupid. Good there job, you go. Peel Good. There. Now get to your feet. Pressure yeah, let's back. Work up. Get to your feet. Head up. Head up. Head up. There we go. Hip heist. Count him. He's pinned. Count him. He's pinned. You caught it earlier. Wow. He goes from a second pin, but all right. Let's go here. Now we're looking at 11-13-2. We need more bonus. We want a pin here. He's got that bar tight. Be smart here. There's the tilt again. Elevate. No. Oh. All right. All right. Call it, I guess, a potential dangerous there. Forty-eight seconds here. And I want to see him force top, but he's been doing well, obviously. Hip Pressure up. him forward. Nice job standing under his arm, staying tight. Good pressure, yep. Good pressure. He's looking tilt again. Hip up. Arm. All right, that's up. fine. Good, 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 smart. No back. I don't know if you no got any counts there. No back. Short time. All right, I'm, yeah, right I'm there. I'm just riding hanging, now. Just hanging right here now. We've got a major. Keep that pressure forward. That's just 10 seconds left. It's, it's major. That was Take a good a, match. That was a pretty good. good technical match. Take a 31-19 lead with that. That's a big win. That's a good win. Nice job. Things will be calm in the Entrican household today. <laughs> well, now I want to win this match too, though. So Absolutely. we got 32 and 38 and 44, right? Three more matches. Yep. We got Trevor here. This is a big, we're looking for six here. Maraglia. Nick Maraglia, okay. Nick's another senior here. Looks like he's seven and two according to track. 
Trevor, a junior, one of our upperclassmen, really. We're a pretty young team. Yeah. Uh, Trevor's, Trevor's been doing a nice job all year. His whole career, really. He's tough. He's a yeah. tough kid. Yeah. He's not afraid of anything. He'll go upper body. He'll go for shots. So. Yeah. He's got that dump right there. If he wants yeah. to hit it, he could hit it. There, there it is. is. He recovered he it. He hits nice that dump job. usually pretty well. Let's get, get your two here if you can. Fish for the head here. Eat up. Yeah, he's got to eat up. Yep. Keep bouncing here. We want to score here. We don't want to. Yeah, there you go. He's, he's he's in keep, pretty coming good up, keep coming up. Keep coming up. Keep coming up. He should be headhunting here yeah, too if he can. If he headhunts, yeah, he's he does. He gets that arm out. Miraculous did a good job. Yeah, that was a good off. flight. Good flight from him. Trevor's Trevor's still in good deep position in. For Keep a him nice in. Nice mat return. That is two, two right there. That's a nice, nice job. job. Good mat sense by Trevor. Great job. Stayed both feet in. Being in the room a little bit this year, I can tell you Trevor's a workhorse too. He works really hard in the room. Yes. Drills really well. Another kid that's improved. You can go across up and down this lineup and see a lot of improved kids, which is a, a testament to their work, a testament to the coaches. You know, if you're seeing kids improve, that's pretty much the hallmark of what's going on in the program. Absolutely. I mean, th th these coaches, I, I can't say anything but good things for them. I mean, just just not even the wrestling aspect. We were talking about it before, but, um, I mean, they do the grade checks, the, the, the 5.30 a.m., you know, mm -hmm. the liftings in the morning, but just – you know, Coach Shields, from my understanding, doesn't allow cursing. Like, yeah. different things like that. The character yeah. is building. Yeah. Trevor's working tough here. He's got that, that ball and chain there. Got two Shields is on the bench tonight with James and Cam. Oh, yeah, Cameron Cam's there. on the bench, too. One of, our, one of our studs from a few years back. A lot of tough guys on that bench. We Cam Shields, James Shields, Nick Arati, Drew Spector over there. He was a three-time district champ, 100-match winner. Nick Arati, couple-time district champ, state qualifier. And I guess I'll throw this out there. You coached them all. I did. <laughs> I did. Ooh. All right, referee stopping that there for potential. I think it was a good call by him. Good job. Yeah, I making think, sure the wrestlers are safe out there. Yeah, anytime you have an arm trapped, and I think yeah. Trevor kind of did a cross yeah. trip. Good period by Trevor. Yeah, it was very workmanlike. This is Nick Miraglia, right? Yeah, yes. he's tough too. Yep. So this is yeah. uh, this is far from over. Yeah, Miraglia, uh, like I said, on according to track, he's seven and two. Now, I have noticed there's some matches missing on track sometimes. It depends on how they're entered, so. Trevor's got that cross. Oh, he let it go. He kind of had that cross first tilt and then pressure. Good pressure. He'll catch jump out sides, Jump sides. He's got that arm caught. Yeah, sure. If he could jump, jump sides, sides, Trevor does have strength. Head hunt a little bit. There it is. There it is. If jump sides and head hunt. There it is. Run it, run it. Oh, wow. Good way to fight off bottom. That was a scary, precarious position there. Yeah. Yeah, pretty much what you always see with college where they came here to fight. You mm -hmm. know, they're, they're tough kids. They're hard-nosed kids. They're well-coached. And, and that, that's an annual thing, regardless of who's on the team. It's always fun to wrestle college with, have a rivalry like that. And we uh, very well will see them again in groups, definitely. Very I, good I mean, chance of that. Yep. So this is a bit – if we win this match, it's, if it's my math's correct, yep. it's sealed. Yeah, if we win this, it's sealed. Trevor, he's still kind of got in control here. Watch the splittle. Well, maybe this was the splittle guy. Watch that splittle. Yeah, Just comes straight across, across Trevor. Trevor. Yeah. You're, you're not going to get that most likely on somebody like Trevor. Trevor, work up here. Good recovery. It's good that Trevor saw that and knows that's something he has in his arsenal now that he needs to try to, you know, avoid mm -hmm. in those positions. You do not want to end up on splittle city. Definitely not. <laughs> and you don't want to be the dad of somebody who ends up on splittle city. <laughs> He's on hard here. He's, yeah. he's doing a nice job on top. I don't want to see him get too crazy. It'll come. I think he did a good job there just knowing where he was mm -hmm. on the mat. I think he was comfortable being out front because he knew he could just scoot out of bounds when he needed to. 
Yeah, Trevor's always been smart when it comes to that. Knowing where you are in the yeah. match, where you are on the mat. You hear a lot of coaches saying, you know, look where you're at, know where you're at. That yeah. basically means get out of bounds without telling you. <laughs> yeah, that's exactly <laughs> what that means. Trevor's got that cross wrist. He's got that tilt. Left, right left, left, left. Be careful. Mm. Nice. Now he's got oh. that. Now he can go right through. Ah. Trevor looks strong at 132. I he think does. this is a, a, a good looking weight for him. I don't know how much weight he's cutting, but he looks he looks big. Yeah, he looks big. And uh, starting this Saturday, all the weights go up. You get a two pound yeah. allowance. You got a dad here that decided to come all the way down and yell at the ref. Oh, I didn't see that. Yeah. The ref does. The ref's doing a nice job. He's he's ignoring it. It's a pretty tense atmosphere here. Yeah. All right, two nothing, third period. Trevor's down. This is uh, kind of where you want to be here. Moraglia going right to that half. Trevor, keep moving, Trevor. Facing. Nice job here. You got to get a little separation here. I want to see right to a shot. Separation. Get your one. There's the one. Gives him a three nothing lead now. Takedown. I, I I would say if Trevor gets a takedown. He's it's pretty much over because he rode him tough. Watch Miraglia going for anything big. Yep. You know, be aware nice of it. Nice duck. Oh, he had it. Nice little cross duck. Just got to step a little deeper there. Trevor looks very calm here. He's not. Control that elbow. Dump. Dump. He's going to look for that dump again. Trevor does have a nice dump. He does have that nice dump. I like how he didn't force it here. Yeah. Could be waiting for him. Again, that's a... That's a Junior that's been around and knows the mat, you know, yep. didn't he force here? it. Very nice. Mm -hmm. Got about 50 seconds left. Just keep your legs back here. So this is definitely just, at this point, nothing, no mistakes. Yeah, you can see all this matchup right here. This is it. Trevor seconds. wins. We win no matter what happens in the next two matches. And it's... Gonsolin needs two scores. So he needs a takedown to a turn or a takedown. Let him up and take him down again with 20 seconds left. So Nice, nice. Yeah, I take it. Yep. Watch the split. -o. There he went there for it. Very nice. Very good and job. That is match. Very nice. Miraglia is looking that way again for that split. Yeah, he was. He's Maybe he's the one that splayed that one. I'll he, to, we'll he, have to find that out. We'll have to look at that box score. <laughs> yeah, I'll have to go back and see. Don't want to give credit to the wrong kid. Nice job. Very nice. Trevor showing the student body some muscles there. <laughs> as long as he does it to our students, that's yeah. good. All right, folks, we're down to two matches left. We looks like... Eight and tie for West Effort. So, yeah. So this is 138. We got a couple guys here. Let's see who they are. 138 moves. Okay, this is Matt Malinowski. Matt Malinowski. Eight and tie. Matt Malinowski. Sophomore. Aiden Ty, younger brother of Andrew Ty. Oof, goes out there. Pretty tough headlock here. Headlock Aiden there. is a fighter, though. He is he strong. He is a fighter, yep. He will not just lay there. Nice job fighting off his back there. Malinowski, 7 and 2 on track. Good wrestler. Comes right out with that headlock. That's tough. Sit, sit, sit. Come on, Aiden. Aiden's a freshman. Had the privilege of coaching him for a couple years before he went over to middle school and came up to here. Great kid. Yeah, he's, he's a great kid. A lot of fight in him, and he's another one, just like you said, just a freshman. I think he's going to be really tough going forward. Oh, yeah. He's, he's doing a great job now, just Oof, trying to battle out there that. All This year. kid has definitely Head thrown headlocks yeah. his whole life, and there there have been some really good headlocks. So. Yeah. Aiden fighting again, through. Aiden fighting through. So much fight in him. Yeah. 
tough. As a freshman at 138 pounds, that's tough too. You're running into some really strong kids. Yeah, that's kind of the meat of most lineups. You know, most kids are about that size in yeah. high school. Aiden, Aiden driving, come right back with a double. Let's go. Finish. Hip Don't up. give it up. Hip up, Aiden. Tough. Effort over outcome. I, I love Aiden's effort. I would like to see him come right back at it. Can never question Oof. his never question his effort. This kid's tough. He transitions well from a headlock to, you know, cradle yeah. to. Got our short time here, eight seconds. <laughs> I would love to see Aiden come on his feet and blow through him with a double here and take him down. Let's see if. Oh, it's kind of which choice here. Taking top. So a turn. Turn. A turn would Turn ends it. Mm -hmm. Kind of interested he went for that when he's headlocked on three ties. Like, if you're looking for a pin, I would have went on our feet, but. I guess his thought process was he's gotten out of it three times, maybe, and he wants the yeah. pin, you know? But again, Aiden's, Aiden's he's a not fighter. Gonna stop. Yep, he's, he's not going to stop. Yep. Stay low here, Aiden. Stay low. Nice Good. job getting his now, I want to see Aiden attack this too. kid. Reattack. Aiden's another one of those kids, really strong. Yep. Everybody that you know, everybody that locks up with him talks about his strength. Just getting more and more experience every day. Good takedown. So one more point will be a tech fall. Nice job by Aiden, still yep. fighting out there. Hips away here, hips, there you go. Nice job, nice job. That wasn't a gimme here in that. Get your hooks back here. You throw the headlock, Aiden. John, you and I have been around a sport a long time, and there's not many kids that's supposed to be fight. attacked that are yeah, fighting this fight. hard. Yeah, he's oh, he throws this. Oh, oh. Throw it, Aiden. Come back up. Let's get to your feet here. You know, he, he wears kids down a little yeah. bit. Yeah. He, because he's always forward, and he's very strong. I'm going to tell you right now, Aiden, Aiden's going to be a good one. And that's going to be, be a right tough there, match. But, but high effort. Absolutely. Yep. Up and down his lineup. I've been impressed. We needed, West Effort needed to come out wrestling like that. They wrestled mm -hmm. hard nosed. Yeah. Um, I think this is good. We're a young group, a lot of juniors. Yeah. And hopefully they see. So this should be Nate, Nate Benner. Nate Benner. And mom and dad got to watch this match, and then we were talking. Yeah, we were they were going to have to leave. Earlier, yeah. Oh, actually, it looks like you're back to Matt Plotz here. So this is the other Okay, Plotz. this is Matt Plotz. So this is, I think he's a freshman, right? Sophomore. Sophomore, okay. Nate's a sophomore himself, I believe. Junior. Sophomore, junior? Junior, junior. yeah. There Nate's really improved. We've been talking about him a lot. Wizard down hard. Got to watch him a little last weekend, a little at the Marinelli tournament. Did a lot of good stuff. Good fight. Nate's another one. I, I don't think he really came out till maybe seventh, eighth grade. We yeah. had a lot of kids that came out around that middle school yeah. time, which is great. That's what you want to see. It's a testament to Coach Jimmer Shields down Jimmer there. Shields. Doing a great job at our middle school. Always does. He's coached at every level from tots all the way up. Yeah, he was at the, I mean, he's, and you got three kids and, you yeah. know, the oldest one's, what, 30, almost 30? Yeah. You're definitely going to be around. His wife, Trisha, she was a big part. They were, uh, yeah. I believe, president yeah. and, uh, of the, of the yeah. junior program. Yeah. 
Control that elbow. Square up. Nate's controlling that elbow well. I like the shot. He just kind of head down and just there stops. There it is. Nice. Keep wrestling Keep here. Keep battling here. Keep battling here, Nate. Good job. Good mat sense. Mat awareness. Throw that oh, underhook. Yeah, yeah, he was walking right into it. Nate definitely appears to have some strength with him, but athleticism. Both guys doing a good job out here attacking. Yeah, this is a scrappy period. Yeah. Keep wrestling here, Nate. Pop up. I don't like. All right. Now let's try to score at the end of this period. Yeah, this through. is a quick one. Then he's high. He's very high. He's he high. Went let's right score here. On, Nate. We want a point eight. here. As we talked about earlier, Collins were the defending Group Two champs in we're South Jersey, right? Yeah, in South Jersey. We're going to be, we're going to definitely be seeing them again. I think. Absolutely. And that match will be different too. We we should have uh, Dominic Gentile back in the yeah. lineup at that point. Yeah. Um, our heavyweight Ramir. So there's. Yeah. A lot of things in the next, a lot of wrestling to do in the next five, yeah. six weeks. Yep. We really just started. Christmas was kind of that lull. I yeah. See the Nate pop right back up. January is where it all gets going. Yep. He's high again. He so Pops definitely gets high. Eat up to that head. head oh. Nate just bounces him up. He hangs that head high a lot. He's getting close he's, here. He's uh, getting close to it. Nate just, I think, doesn't really know how to defend legs too much. He's in a tough spot here. He's got to go the other way. Oh, go the other way. Oh, wow. All right, well, that's going to do it. That is going to do it. 34-30, West Stepford Eagles beat Collingswood. Final score of the evening, West Stepford 34, Collingswood 30. Good match. Good Great match. match. Some yeah. stuff to work on. Uh, some good stuff. Some stuff that needs to be worked on. Like always, no such thing as a perfect match. And we'll probably see this team again. But big win over a good team. Nice job by our West Stepford Eagles. And Brad, always good. That was fun, man. Always fun. My old teammate here. <laughs> and uh, so, yes, we'll see you guys soon. See you next time. Nice job. Go Eagles.